Hey, howdy, hey, everyone. Welcome back to Orca. We're going to be taking on level three. Uh, we got our new weapons equipped, and I can't wait to see how this new level looks. So let's go ahead and go to level one. And also the music. Wow, beautiful. We want to, what? This here is something I said. I wouldn't, I'm not paying attention. I'm looking at the level and everything. What in the world is that? on the internet, boy. Woo! I love it. Get download this soundtrack. Everybody, let's dance! Oh! Can you imagine if, like, our re if our reality was like, if, like, instead of violence, people dance their problems, dance their problems. Like, if someone had like beat somebody, think about like, how can I say it? Think about it like this. Think about some. Hardcore gangster or whatever. Two gangsters, right? They get into like a little incident which caused them to argue. And instead of like pulling out a gun or something like that, what if they said, you know what? Let's handle this like real men. Show me your best moves, sucker. <laughs> and they start dancing. Like, uh, 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 beat that. You know? <laughs> like, what, what if that was like a. What if that was like the biggest crime? Like, if someone wanted to steal a TV from Best Buy or something like that, they say, you know what? I want to steal this TV. And the, the, the clerk is like, all right, show me your best moves. If you got, if you got like, the, if you got some good moves, I'll give you this TV. But when the <laughs> What kind of world I live in? I don't know, but <laughs> what if it was like that, though? I'd be dancing my uh, hardest. I'd try to do, I don't know. Who's a good dancer? Uh, Chris Brown? Yeah, I guess he's a good dancer. I would try to dance like Chris Brown and do whatever I want. Like, if you want a Lamborghini, if you got the money to buy it, you can try to dance for it. You better be good. <laughs> if someone taking a TV, still on the TV, they had to dance for it. And the police, they were like, I don't know, like, I'm trying to think. Like, I wanted to sound, it's already stupid, <laughs> but I wanted to be like, how can I say it? Like, if you had to dance, like, if you couldn't afford a TV and you dance for it, but it's, in that reality, it's basically stealing. So the police will come after you. So how would the police handle it? Like... You had to you had to try and beat them in a dance off to keep the TV or not. Police was like, okay, you danced pretty good and you took that TV, but you didn't pay for it. So now you have to deal with us. And then they start dancing. It's like if you beat me in a dance off, we'll let you keep that TV. And the robber is like, alright. They start, you know, getting down, spinning on their head and stuff. Oh. Would that world, that reality I just spoke of, would that be so bad of a place to live in? I, I, yeah, I would say so, because, like, that, that way, anyway, can, anyone can steal your stuff. Because, like, it's, okay, think about it like this. If you're in your house, right, and someone just just came in your house and said, you know what, I want, I want your TV. I want everything in your house, or whatever. And you, like, 
In order to protect yourself, in this reality, you don't use violence or anything like that. You dance. So you will have to try and dance and try and, you know, beat the robber or whatever in a dance off if you want your stuff. So I, I think if, if someone can't dance, that'd be pretty bad. But you could just take something from anyone. Especially old people. Well, no, I can't say that. Those people can get down too. Jellyfish. Oh my God. Same rules apply to like underwater sea life. Like if a shark comes up to you and you're underwater, and the shark like I want to take a bite out of you, and you be like, all right, but well, we gotta dance first. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'm just talking stupid now. <laughs> a shark can't dance. I don't know. Then again, can a shark dance? It can wiggle. That that I mean, doing a wiggle is a dance move. It better be some good wiggling. Oh, so many corals die. Let's go down before it hit us. Oh! Okay. Did it hit me? No, no, I got it. If I lived in that dance in reality, I would, I would study real hard on how to dance. Like I, 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 I would say that I'm a, I would say I'm a, I'm okay dancing. I mean, I've gotten kind of fat. I've gotten pretty fat lately, so I probably can't dance as good anymore. But if, if, if I drop the weight, I could probably go back to dancing really good. And I would most definitely do that. And like try and. Now, what would I do with my dancing powers? That's not really a power, my dancing style. I would try and... I would try to... I don't know. I'll try to start my own business. Try, try to get some kind of business going so I can like make money that way. A lot more money that way. And like, uh, keep on adding on to my business and spread out my company or whatever I'm trying to do. And I would dance for it. Like, I would. Oh my god, okay. Getting crazy now. Like, I don't know. I would. Somehow, because like. If you could just dance for whatever you want, if you're a good enough dancer, that is, I mean, you have to be top notch. I mean, you have to be, and what, what I'm saying is, it's, you can't decide who, like, if you challenge someone to a dance off, you have to be the one to impress the, that one, that person that you challenge. Like, okay, like, if you go into the Walmart and you say, I want this can of peanuts, but I don't, I don't want to pay for it, and so I want to dance for it. You have to be the one to impress the sales clerk or whatever to make him say, "Okay, you know what? Those were some good, those were some pretty good moves out here. You can have the peanuts or whatever." So it's not gonna be like that reality. That's not gonna be easy. Okay, poison coral. Hang on, sorry, daddy. What? Oh, what in the world? Okay. Gonna be 
my first death. I just know it. I'm, there's no way. I'm gonna have to try and fight the boss without getting hit anymore. Silly reality if you dance somebody to death. Like, could they, they'll be dead, but they won't be really dead. They'll just be pretending. Like, <laughs> like you dance. So let's say someone saying, "Hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna K you." I can't say it on YouTube, but I'm gonna K you. And it's like, all right, well, then you got to dance if you want to K me. Uh, so you start dancing, and you dance better than him. And he's like, all right, I guess I'm dead. <laughs> and then he just lays on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> and that person is pronounced dead to, to everybody in that reality. I don't know. My 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 ideals are stupid. <laughs> I'm just saying. What if would that be a good reality to live in? Cause like it wouldn't be like there wouldn't be no real crime, right? There wouldn't be no real crime. So would that be like a good reality to live in? Like even though like the rules. Of that reality is so odd and weird. Even though it's weird and odd, would it still be like a, a, a safe reality? Because like you you'll dance for everything. Like when people want to steal, they had to dance for it. They want to rob you, you gotta dance for it. They gotta dance better than you in order for them to take whatever it is. If you get into a car wreck, who's gonna pay for it? You have to dance and figure out. You know, whoever is the best dancer, if you, you know, if it's your fault, if you run into someone and it's your fault, but that guy danced better than you, no, if you dance better than him, then it's his fault, because he's not a good dancer. I don't know, I'm just stupid. <laughs> anyway, guys, that's going to be it for the video. Tune in tomorrow for uh, a new episode of Orca. Orca. And yeah, like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Like, comment, subscribe, dance, and all that good stuff. <laughs> and I'll get you guys later. All right. Game over. <laughs>